As said previously, the shoulder joint is one of the most frequently dislocated joints in the body. Dislocations at the shoulder are described by where the humeral head lies in relation to the glenoid fossa. 95% of shoulder dislocations are anterior dislocations. However, posterior and inferior dislocations can also occur, about 4% and 1% respectively. Superior displacement is prevented by the coracochromial arch. The most common type of dislocation is anterior dislocation, and it's a result of excessive extension and external rotation of the humerus. In anterior dislocation, the humeral head is forced anteriorly and inferiorly into the weakest point of the joint capsule. Now, if the joint capsule is torn, there is an increased risk of future dislocations. 